beginning of our this burn lasts about 36 seconds long. Stage two FTS is saved. Well, that entry burn continues. We're just about a minute away from Seco. We'll have a number of events all happen in rapid succession. It'll be the second engine cutoff. They wanted to be looking for that uh, stage one landing burn shortly after. Actually, just within a few seconds of each other. Such a cool view on your left screen, seeing Bob and Doug on Dragon. And now you can see the displays that they are seeing right now themselves. Terminal guidance. And back to Alpha. We are coming up 25 seconds or so away from Seco, or second engine cutoff. This is also the point where Bob and Doug are experiencing their highest G-force. We're seeing the counter tick up to right about 1.8. Call me Shannon. You heard Shannon, so that just means they're in their final abort zones. If they were to abort at this point, would either be in abort to orbit or to land off the coast of Ireland. Standing by for second one line off third. confirmation. And back to all step. And back shut down. Did one line away. Confirmation of Seco's second engine cutoff. Now we are waiting for our first stage to make its way to our drone ship. Of course, I still love Dragon, it. Dragon, SpaceX, nominal orbital insertion. Launch escape system. Confirmation of nominal orbital Dragon, yeah, insertion. Nominal orbital insertion. What you're seeing on your screen is a live view of our drone ship, where our first stage will be coming down. Looks like we lost that live view, but... We'll wait for confirmation of that landing shortly here. Falcon 9 first stage is successfully landed. And there you can see on your screen, Falcon 9 has landed. This is the first Falcon 9 to carry humans to orbit, so very exciting for us. And as you can see on your right screen, Bob and Doug are still making their way to their targeted orbit. Hello, <laughs> meter recovery one. So exciting today. 